Hello everybody, thank you for tuning in to another episode of NotAnalog.com. Today I'm looking at something very different and something which I haven't actually used myself in a very long time. It's a clock radio. Now, something which I used to use a lot when I was a kid and eventually as the advent of smartphones came around I started to use them as my alarm clock and no longer needed this sitting on my bedside table to wake me up in the morning. Now, the reason I've decided to look at this particular product and I've never reviewed a clock radio before is because of one key feature. When you flip the lid on top, it's got an iPhone 5 lightning connector. Now, even just in terms of speaker docks, that's very rare to see. In fact, I don't know of many speaker docks currently at this point of review uh, which have a iPhone 5 connector, which made it interesting for me for two reasons. One, that means that you can wake up to music from your iPhone 5 which is a better quality speaker than what your iPhone is. So you kind of enjoy waking up a little bit more than normal. Secondly, it charges your iPhone, which kind of displaces the whole idea of having it charged with a separate cable on your bedside table anyway. And it's got a large snooze button as well, which if you've woken up with your iPhone before, you know how annoying it can be to try and silence it and turn it off. So that was kind of handy, but that was the biggest feature. Now obviously when I started looking at it, okay, well I'm looking at a clock radio, I should actually try and seriously look at one. Two key features on it which I enjoyed was the dual alarm. I quite like the fact that you can set one for say the wife and one for the husband, A and B. They go off at different times, they can even wake up to different things. So you can have one go off with the iPhone and then B goes off with the, with the radio for example. Um, it's also super handy as a speaker dock. So if you've got an iPhone 5 and you're struggling to find um, speaker docks for it, this is really good for the bedroom. You put this in there, the sound quality is pretty good. It does look a little bit like a toilet roll, let's be honest, but the sound quality is actually quite good out of this Sony device because, you know what, Sony tends to make pretty decent speakers, audio products as it is anyway. Um, if you don't have an iPhone 5, it has got an audio in port as well, so you can plug anything with a 3.5mm connector, which is any phone, including Sony phones. Um, but also, when you look at the functions, it's all very simple. Play, pause, radio on, off. Anybody could use this, um, regardless of your, of your age. It's very simple to use. And I love the fact it has an iPhone 5 connector. Did I mention that already? Um, and if you're not using it, you can just flip the lid down, and it's kind of hidden away. Very small. It's about 100 bucks, so it is cheap. If you're somebody who still enjoys your uh, clock radios and still needs one, nothing wrong with that, especially when you're putting your smartphone and this together, I can kind of understand it. If you're looking for something to provide music in the bedroom and you don't want to go and spend big money on, a, on an audio dock, this will do the job just fine. In the, in the room that I'm in, um, using this was perfect. I could listen to the radio, it's remote controllable as well, and, uh, and tunes were great, especially listening to podcasts or, or music. It was just simple, and you just dock it and it works. I enjoyed that. Um, it's simple, it's good. It's the Sony ICF C11IP. Write that one down. Check it out in store. It is really handy. If you're not into it, not your kind of thing, think of it as a gift for your parents. Honestly, when I showed this to people who are older than myself, they started getting pretty excited because it's good and they love them. They still love them. Check it out from Sony. It's a clock radio. Welcome back. Thanks, guys. Bye.